this video we gonna talk about how to fix issue with the import JavaFX in Eclipse that giving you the errors. So it should come to path to JavaFX library is not uh, seeing when you import. Before you going to fix this, verify that you have at least JDK 1.8. If you don't have it, just install JDK 1.8. And there are two ways to fix this. One to add the access rules. Another one to add JDK 1.8. If you don't have JDK 1.8, then you're probably going to do the second method. I to install the JDK 1.8. So this is the errors that we see. Even we have a correct package, right? We import. So now let me show you the second way first. Even you don't have, I mean, even you have 1.8, you can do the second way too. By default, Eclipse is going to use the Java SE 1.8, which you already have 1.8, right? Standard edition. Then you can either pick like first method or second method, but let me show you the second method. What you're going to do, you right click on the project, right? Go to properties and click on java build path and you probably going to see GRE which is 1.8 okay so the first way you pretty much just go here and change the access rules right since I'm here I'm going to show you first way then access rule here when you can add and what you need to type is java xd you have to allow accessible to that Java FX and then slash and then you do just wildcard meaning matches any number of segments and hit OK and hit OK right so after you redefine the rules you apply and the errors go away right now this error is actually just you need to add an implement the method for start for JavaFX. Okay, so that's showing you the first way, right, how to fix that at the access roof, right? Now let's see, let's go to show you the second way. Maybe I pick one of this program. When I start to do extends application, right? and try to import javafx dot you may notice that you probably have to do it every time when you dealing with the new project see that you can do instead of using the J, java se you can do jdk by adding the library here GRE we going to use yeah the JDK like normally you may not see this right you probably has to go down here first and add right if you don't see that add to the location where you have your after you download and store your JDK this is going to be in the case that you need to have 1.8 JDK, it's going to be under C program files, right? And then Java. After install it, that's the path. JDK 1.8. It could be the latest underscore, right? 101 and so on. It depends on the updates that you get. Like now, I have update 101. So just make sure it's JDK 1.8 as the minimum. So you should be good. At the time of recording, there's 1.8 updates. 101 is the latest one. Even when it's come to 1.9, it should be okay too, right? And you have to have the root not bin, so it's gonna pick up all the libraries which should include JavaFX in here. JFX, see that? That what we need, and then you can just hit finish. Like now, 
after you do that it's going to pick up on here you it's going to show you just select that select that hit ok and just pick that on the list jdk we hit finish and most likely you don't need it the, the default one just use this jdk just remove that one hit ok and then as it's fixed the problem again right so that's another way to fix the problem so this error like I said this is just need to add the structure for JavaX and there is fixed <laughs>